It's Connie Brower from Nova Scotia, Canada. It is Thursday, Mar uh, April 28th, and it's just a few days away from the election, the Canadian election. And I just want to let you people know about a few things about some of these candidates. In Nova Scotia, the candidates are Scott Bryson for Liberal, uh, David Morris for Conservative, and then um, the NDP and the Green parties. I want to talk about how these people have affected the family law industry here in Nova Scotia. They have done nothing to protect family law and equal rights for parents in Nova Scotia and in Canada. In fact, David Morse, who I'm going to call Monster Morse, was the former Nova Scotia Minister of Community Services. And during his watch, he allowed a child to be stolen from their parents by the judicial system. That's Children's Aid and Judges for no reason whatsoever. He did not interfere. He did not get involved. He did not call a public inquiry. He did nothing while this baby was stolen for no reason. I was there. I saw it. I tried to get in touch with David Morris, and he was inaccessible. I'd like to know what the hell these ministers are doing if they're inaccessible to the public. And that goes for Scott Bryson, too. We have been tortured, abused, um, had our parental rights violated, uh, we've had been assaulted, we've had fraud, ch child support fraud uh, committed against my husband for the last six years for a missing adult man. This adult man was 19 in 2005 and it is 2011. So for six years, we have had to pay child support for a fraudulent child support order. We've had 23 judges, 23 judicial applications, and not one of them would take it off. We had to file in the Supreme Court of Canada. Can you picture this? To terminate child support for a missing adult man who was on the age over the age of majority in 2005 we had to apply to the Supreme Court of Canada to get him off and we're still waiting that application is still pending we've also filed for criminal charges to be levied against these judges and there's 23 of them this is just all this time we've had to fight and fight and fight just to get child support off of an adult man. That isn't even saying anything about the exorbitant child support we paid before he was 19. This is fraud and it's going and it has been committed by Paulette Harris who has been collecting the money all this time for six years while not giving any information uh, where the, the man is or the other two siblings and not giving us any information and not giving us any access to him. Now what kind of a country is this? Is this freaking Iraq? I warn you people not to elect these people. Don't vote for these people. Not Scott Bryson, not David Morris, not any of these politicians, not Harper, uh, not Layton, because none of them care about families. They are dangerous to families. I'm warning you, go to my, my website and see for yourself. StopTheTorture.info StopTheTorture.info You will see it all there.